by way of Amanda Swim. So we begin in Superman. You want to make sure the eyes are looking down, the legs are together outstretched behind us, hands are arcing down. After we've gone through those first three moves, we want to start with the catch. The catch leaves the elbow in place, we scoop towards the chest. When we do that, that leverages our hip up, so we should start to have that tipping feeling of the upper body and the hip. The next piece is once we've got to the catch position, we want to go all the way through and push towards the thigh. The catch sets the paddle, the paddle pushes you through the water. Making sure to practice on both sides helps to make sure that the stroke is the same on both sides. We have a tendency to want to practice on our best side. The next portion is coordinating the kick. So to do that we want to just start with the catch. By lifting the leg first, you know which side you're engaging, and then move for the catch. So as the kick is over so much quicker than the actual pull of the arm, we want to just break it down to the catch position so we're not rushing our stroke. So once we've completed the kick and the catch, then we can go through to the pull. Nicely done. So once we've done our kick and catch, it lifts the hip, you glide through the water, and as you lose momentum, you'll fall flat. So over the water, the recovery is the elbow pulls the arm forward. So by leaving the hand in the water when we do this, you can have that feeling of resistance and it'll be the elbow pulling the hand forward rather than the hand moving on its own. So moving from one stroke to the next stroke. Uh, when we pause in Superman, it allows us to double check that we're still getting everything correct. And then eventually we'll want to take that pause of Superman out between the strokes. And remember that it goes from one hip up to the other hip up. And you get that tip to your swim where it's either on one hip or the other. From the front here, we can see that hip going all the way through. Nicely done. So once we move that hip through, we start to get that momentum that we're trying to build out of the stroke. Good work. 